In 1897, to this company started. We went from stagecoaches to cruise ships to train stations to airports. So our job is to really serve travelers, something we're passionate about. In most cases, these individuals are in the middle of a journey, driving the highways or waiting in line in the airport to go through security. We get them and we have a great opportunity to make a real difference in their day. HMS hosts approach to innovation first and foremost. We want to continue to provide that great customer experience, not making the customer feel uncomfortable when they come into a store, giving them the speed of service that they demand when they're in an airport environment. Our ethos as a company is providing the best guest experience possible. Customers are expecting certain things with the evolution of mobile devices, the evolution in digital space. So it's really important that we understand what they are using, what they are expecting, and aligning our innovation aspirations against that. Innovation means everything, right? It's, it's really improvement. How we train our people, how we schedule our employees, putting the right POS system in, the grab-and-goes that we put in restaurants and the sustainable packaging that goes along with that, that's innovative, right? That's something different and new that other people don't do. Innovation is taking and transforming an idea that increases the value perception to our customer. We have a world-class group of chefs from the very best chef houses in the country. We're going to roast a little bit of duck in the pan. We have a little fresh fig and mustard glaze here. People want to start to taste what the city tastes like in their local airport. We were the first ones to bring celebrity chefs, local restaurants, and convert them into an authentic experience in an airport environment. And we have a food truck in an airport, believe it or not, in Los Angeles. It's in a food court and it changes every six months. We have an urban garden in Chicago O'Hare where we actually grow vegetables, herbs, and spices, and we actually use them in the food, and it's inside the airport. It's all hydroponic. It's turned into one of the favorite spots in O'Hare where people come, they drink wine, and they look at the garden. It's an incredible place. The 1897 market is one of our innovations that's out there today. It's a full sensory experience. There's a full-service restaurant. There's a raw bar. There's an incredible cocktail lounge. There's a QSR station that has pizza, it has deli, there's a retail location, there's a soft seating area that's very quiet that you can sit back and just relax if you want to. It's something you would see in a downtown area or marketplace in London or you might see in New York, but it sits in Charlotte. There are a certain number of passengers that we consider gate huggers that don't necessarily go to a restaurant to eat, so we felt it was important to deliver a great food and beverage experience to them. So in Nashville, we started a food cycle. On it, salads, sandwiches, snacks, and, and beverages that would deliver food to the customer at the gate when the customers were getting ready to board their flights. Started out in Nashville and now moved on to Memphis because it's been so successful. In restaurants, we're dealing with tablet technology the ability for the customer to order at the table without having to interact with an associate. And then they get their food, and then they can pay on the device. If you want to grab a sandwich, you can key that in there. They'll have the order ready for you. You've already paid for it. And then you can pick it up, get to your gate on time. One of the most important things we've done, I think, is a server-driven tablet. We're allowing the customer to be served by a waiter or waitress with a tablet in their hands. The information can get back to the kitchen in a timely manner, but the customer doesn't have to interact with the technology. When we speak about innovation, the idea and the thought isn't that it is always technology. Innovation comes to us in creative ways, in very dynamic ways to really deliver the experience that the customers are demanding. Technology is giving access to information real time, allowing our customers to pass through that journey while having access to everything that they need and they desire without really having to look for it. A lot of times in an absence of technology, you're going to have to go through the entire terminal to figure out what's there and what options you have available from a dining standpoint. When you deliver technological solutions, you are giving them access to information about their flights, delays, potential changes, thereby equipping them with information that allows them to handle their journey and give the control back to the customer. The most important innovations in the future will be the ones where we can drive the customer to make a lot of the decisions digitally. It gives you some information on price, then you can add from that screen if you want. We're about to launch our mobile application, putting information in the customer's hands, everything and anything they need from a travel perspective, but still providing great customer service when they arrive at our location. They order from their mobile device from one of our restaurants, they pay for it, they get loyalty reward points for that. When they come up to pick up the food, we're giving them great customer experience. If you think about the people we touch every day and the people we get to serve, it could be a child's first flight, a couple on their honeymoon, a family who's grieving, going to a funeral. Be a teenager on a team going to play a championship game or a business person who's going to do the biggest deal of their life. Each of those need states needs something from us. We have a responsibility and quite frankly
frankly a privilege to serve them on their way, to bring some sanity and a kind of an insane process of going into an airport and flying away. That's our duty in all of this, is to be just that little oasis for them as they move on. Thank you.